Promoting your sales video with a custom YouTube ad campaign. Hey there, everyone. We've come through all the right strategies that top YouTube businesses and marketers apply to grow their channels. So now we are going to take this training to the next level. If you want to get more results and get them fast, then you have to invest some money in ads. In the upcoming lessons, we are going to show you how to set up paid advertising campaigns to boost your YouTube business videos. Starting with this lesson, where we are going to show you how to promote your video with a custom YouTube ad campaign. Getting started. To create a custom YouTube ad campaign to promote your video, go to your YouTube Studio dashboard by clicking on the Profile menu button and then on the YouTube Studio option. Next, click on the Videos tab. Locate the video that you want to promote. Click on the Options icon and then click on the Promote option from the display menu. On the following page, click on the Get Started button. This will take you to the Google Ads dashboard from where you can create your custom YouTube ad campaign. Creating the campaign. Start by clicking on New Campaign. On the following page, you are going to select your campaign goal. To create a custom campaign, select the Create a Campaign Without a Goals Assistance option. Now select Video as a campaign type. Then select Custom Video Campaign as a campaign subtype and click on Continue. Now you are going to customize the campaign. Start by entering the name of your new campaign into the Campaign Name field. As you can see here, Maximum Cost Per View is selected by default in the Bidding Strategy section. This means that you will only pay when someone views your video ad. This is the optimum strategy for this campaign. So let's skip to the Budget and Date section. Here you are going to enter your ad spend and your schedules. Start by clicking on the Budget Type menu button and select Daily. Now enter the amount you want to spend daily on ads. You can start with a low number, such as $5 or $10, and can scale it from there. By default, your campaign is set to start as soon as ads approved with no end date. But you can edit this schedule if you prefer to launch this campaign on a later date. Now click on the Languages tab. Click on the Enter Language field and select your target language from the display menu. It is always better to select the language of your video but you can select additional languages if you added captions to the video that you'll promote. Now click on the Locations tab and select your target locations. Here you are going to select locations where people speak your target language and where people are more likely to purchase your products after watching your video ad. Now scroll down and enter the ad group name into the ad group field. This is where Google Ads will save the ads that you create in this campaign. Now click on the Demographics tab. Here you are going to check the demographic attributes that best describe your perfect customer. Now click on the Audiences tab. Here you are going to select attributes that define your audience. It can be an interest, an industry, or a customer lifecycle stage. The easiest way to use this feature is to enter a related keyword into the search box and to select one or more attributes from the results. Once you are done here, Move to the Content section and click on the Keywords tab. Here you are simply going to enter your keywords and search terms into the Keywords field. Now click on the Topics tab. Here you are going to select the topic that you want to target. The easiest way to make your selections is to simply locate and select your topic or topics from the menu. Now click on the Placements tab. Here you can select specific placements to show your video ads. Use this feature only if your plan is to target a very specific audience on a very specific placement, such as subscribers and viewers of a YouTube channel or visitors of a specific website. All you have to do here is to enter your keyword into the search box and to select placements from the results. In this example, we don't want to narrow down our reach to specific placements, so we will skip this selection. Now in the bidding section, you are going to enter the maximum bid that you are willing to place for each unique view. Setting up the video ad and launching the campaign. Alright friends, now it is time to set up the video ad. Start by adding your video ad to the creative. You can do this by typing the name of your video in the search for a video bar 
or simply by entering your video URL into the same search bar. Now you have to select the ad format. For this example, we are going to select skippable in-stream ad to show our video ad when viewers are watching other videos. Now enter your product or sales page URL into the final URL field. Then click on the display URL field to generate the display URL for the ad. Now enter the name of this new ad into the ad name field and then click on the create campaign button. And now that your campaign is set, review your campaign settings and click on continue to campaign. And that's it.